Hello everyone, welcome! My name is Paula and today I'm going to guide you through to yoga class for beginners. Leave a like, subscribe and share with your friends. See you! Now sit the buttocks onto the heels with the big toes touching and the knees as wide as the hips or even as wide as the mat. Keep the buttocks resting on the heels with fingertips on floor. Inhale, look forward, lifting the open the chest. Exhale, keeping buttocks on heels and walk hands forward. Bring the upper body down towards the floor and rest the heads on the floor. Hold and breathe. To release, inhale, look forward, and on the next exhalation, walk hands back, drawing the belly upright. Now, start on your hands and the knees in a tabletop position. Make sure your knees are set directly below your hips and the wrists directly below your shoulders. Spread your fingers, center your head in a neutral position. Eyes look at the floor, elbows unlock it and elbow creases face each other. Inhale. Lift the sitting bones, lengthen the belly, and the chest move forward. Gently look forward. Exhale, curl the tailbone under, lift back to ceiling and draw chin to chest. Continue back and forth with your own breath. Focus on lengthening the spine. Now, to release, take Botox to heels and come back into Balasana, Child Pose. Now, from Balasana, come up onto the hands and the knees. Check the position of the hands, shoulders wide apart, slightly wider. Take knees and the feet wide apart. Exhale as you lift the sit bones towards the ceiling. Relax your head and the neck. Avoid hyperextending the elbows and the knees, micro bend if necessary. Now, place your left foot in front of the mat, followed by your right foot, and stand in Tadasana. Now, 
Now, come to stand at the front of the mat with big toes together and the ankles touching or slightly apart, with equal weight in back and the front of feet. Lift up arcos of the feet, lift knee cups, engage quadriceps, but keep a micro bend in knees. Buttocks slightly firm, lower abdominal muscles moving in and up. Keep extending upwards through spine with shoulders relaxed down. Head extend upwards through the crown. If you prefer, close your eyes or look down towards the heart center. Your hands are placed in line with your hips. Now inhale into Urdhva Vahastasana. Raise the arms, palms face towards each other. Look up only if it is comfortable for the neck. Exhale into Uttanasana. Bend your knees to protect your lower back and lift the seat bones. Rest the hands towards the floor. Relax your head. Relax your neck. Inhale to a half lift, looking down, lift the chest, flatten the back with the fingertips resting in line with the toes, bend the knees if necessary. Exhale, Ashvasan Shalanasana, step the left foot back and the lower onto the right knee. Inhale and lift the chest, look down and forward, keep the hands on the floor, shoulders wide apart and stretch up onto the fingertips, check knee alignment, keep knee aligned above the heel. Exhale and step the right foot back into extended balasana, child pose. Rest the buttocks on the heels and keep the hands stretching forward. Now inhale into Bhujangasana. Scoop your body through between your hands, keep elbows, shoulders wide. Spread the fingers, squeeze the shoulders blades together. Lift the chest and drops the shoulders away from the ears. Look ahead and then down and with a long neck. Place the feet hip wide apart. Exhale into Adumukha Shavasana, Dal Face Dog. Place hands, shoulders wide apart, with the fingers evenly spread. Bring, bring weight down on the third neck of the index finger. Upper back broad. Move the shoulders apart and towards your buttocks. Relax the head and neck. Position the feet, hip wide apart, and slightly pigeon toe, so the other wide edges of the feet are parallel to edges of the mat. Stretch the legs if a hamstring allows. Inhale and step your left foot back. Exhale. Look forward and step your right foot together in front of the mat. Inhale into Urdhva Vahastasana. And exhale, lower the hands and the arms into Tadasana. Tadasana Mountain Pose. Inhale into Urdhva Hastasana. Raise the arms, palms face towards each other as you line the spine. Look up only if it is comfortable for the neck. Exhale into Uttanasana. Bend the knees to protect the lower back and lift the sit bones. Rest the hands towards the floor, relax the head and relax the neck. Inhale to a half lift, 
lift the chest, flatten the back with the fingertips resting line with the toes. Exhale, Ashwasan Shalanasana, step the right foot back and lower onto the right knee. Inhale, lift the chest, look down and forward. Keep the hands on the floor, shoulders wide apart and stretch up onto the fingertips. Exhale, step the left foot back into extended balasana. Rest the buttocks on the heels, keep the hands stretching forward. Inhale into Bhujangasana. Scoop your body between your hands and keep the elbows, shoulders wide. Lift the chest and drop the shoulders away from the ears. Exhale into Adumukha Shavasana. Down face dog. Place hands, shoulders wide apart with the fingers evenly spread. Bring weight down eight on the third knuckle of the index finger. Inhale, step the right foot forward in front of the mat. Step the left foot forward to Uttanasana. Inhale, bend the knees. In Uttanasana, raise the arms and lift the torso. Stretch the arms towards the ceiling. Exhale and lower the arms into Tadasana. Now, sit in front of the mat with your knees bent and the feet flat on the floor. React with your left hand under your left knees and take hold of your right foot, drawing heel back beside the left buttocks. Take the left foot over the right legs, drawing the heel back beside the right buttocks. Now, place the hands on the left knees Keeping the spine central, chest lift, shoulders relaxed, and draw chin slightly to chest. And close the eyes if you prefer. Inhale, raise the right arms, facing back. Exhale, bend the left elbows and take fingers to spine. Take the left arms around behind the back. Take the back of the left hand to spine, join hands, and now you can use a strap if they do not react. Hold and breathe. Exhale and release the arms onto the knees. Change the side of the strap and he cross the legs to the opposite way. Now inhale, raise the left arms, palms face back. Exhale, bend the left elbows and take fingers to spine. Take the right arms around behind the back. And now take the back of the right hand to spine. Join the hands. Use a strap if they do not react. Hold and breathe. To 
please exhale and place the hands to the knees. Now, slowly lie on the mat, your palms facing up. The back of the neck is kept long. The head and spine should be in a straight line. The eyes are closed, relax the whole body, and you try to stop physical movement. Become aware of the natural breath and allow it to become rhythmic and relax. If you prefer, you can stay in that position for a few more minutes or you can slowly bring awareness to your body. When you're ready, gentle, start moving your fingers and your toes. Bend your knees and roll to the right side. Keep your eyes closed. Slowly sit in a comfort position. Now take a deep breath in and out. Thank you so much everyone to join me today. Namaste.